Just gonna go for Heigang so he doesn't Heigang me. Rather steal than anything. A few things I could do right now. I could go for a combination of these two, but then it's a simple ban on his side, I guess. No, I think I'll still go for it. Chiwu, so he's 100% gonna be banning out this thing. So if I land right now on the Layla and then push back, then I'm Gucci to go. Okay, that thing does move first, but I think I fear this thing less. Or do I even? No, I think I will hit it. Okay, well that's still kind of fine actually. That is less fine. Oh wait, did Oliver just miss two out of two already? Yeah, he did. <laughs> Fucking Oliver, bro. Oliver missed two out of two when he had the first pro. Okay, okay. Oh, uh, wait, he's gonna move in front as well. Wait, Raigeki, what the fuck, bro? <laughs> My Oliver misses two out of two? Don't silence. Oh, uh, he did even get the silence wrong element. Oliver missed two out of two? Okay, at least we have that going for us. At least we were able to proc back. Okay, okay, we're proccing back. That's that's apparently the thing. The only difference is if my units proc, your team goes bye-bye. Uh, <laughs> what the fuck is this proc city, bro? What? <laughs> what? Literally all units that could proc, did proc in that whole match. Uh, Oliver's 85. Uh, I made a, uh, a, a boomer of an Oliver that's a little bit too high on speed. But it's kind of fine. That's pretty much the reason that I did outspeed him in the last round. Because he had pretty fast units as well. But not this fast. And he has like the accuracy S2 and S3 on 15s. So that makes it 85. F9 Chiu. Okay, okay. Makes sense, makes sense. Uh, let's drop in Dimasha. Bella. Not sure if I really fear a Bella. Cigar. Mellow cigar, okay. Hmm. It's probably to go monkey. Yeah, I kind of like monkey, but th then what do we ban? What makes most sense in banning? Camilla is going to be annoying. Is it going to be that bad though? This could do me a lot of damage, but it's easy to kill. Same for these two actually. This will kind of guarantee me first turn ish. No, I could still go with Athna skills. I think I'll go for this. Because I expected that ban, yes. What's the best unit to play with Smicer? Bruiser units like Fire Monkey, Camillas, that kind of stuff. Hmm. So in this position, I think it is actually better to just get rid of you. Nice damage. Not bad. Okay. If I had that armor break early on, I would have fucked him up already, but it still resets, so it's kind of fine. No proc, that's good, so you have your skill back soon. Not bad damage for a Masha that's on crit rate rather than crit damage. Actually should have tried to force stun on you. Well, I can also just go for a kill this way. Jeez. Of Will Sierra? Yeah, you do see it from time to time. Most of the time they're revenge then. 
But before we get into the video, let's look at the sponsor of today's video, which is the Huawei App Gallery. And that is my way to get all of these packs cheaper. And I highly recommend you to use that as well. So what do you have to do for it? First, you have to install the Huawei App Gallery through the link that's in the description. Afterwards, you would have to install the HMS Core and you have to create an account on it. Once you've done all of that, you would have to select your region. I recommend to select either Germany if you're paying with yours or Switzerland if you're not paying with yours. Those will give you the recommended discounts. Afterwards, within here, we're going to search for Summoner's War. We see the game from here. We install it. After installing, we can also check the campaigns that are currently running on this page. The campaign is also linked in the description down below. Within the campaign, we can actually see what kind of discounts are currently running. If we scroll a little bit down, we see Offer 1. And the Offer 1 is just a few coupons that we can use on a one-time claim. And those are for your first purchases. Afterwards, we see Offer 2, which is cashback. And you get three times the option on the dates that are listed over there to get cash back if you buy a pack afterwards you can claim back huawei points and those huawei points you can once again use for your next purchase then we also have offer three this is the big one once again you purchase something before afterwards you get diamonds those diamonds you can trade in for a coupon and that coupon you can use for your next purchase all the way to the bottom they also have a link to the discord i highly recommend joining their discord on their discord you can ask any questions and also keep track of all of their campaigns how would it look like if we would purchase anything from the Huawei App Gallery? Once we open the game through the Huawei App Gallery, we've selected the pack that we would like to buy. Here we can see the options that we can pay with. Personally, I go by PayPal. Within here, you could also select that you would want to buy it either by the coupons that you claimed or the Huawei points that you previously got. Once we click pay, it will black out the screen for a moment because you have to fill in a pin and you have to do your payment method. Afterward, we see the payment result. Don't click on OK right away because this is where you want to scroll down a little bit. And this is where you can normally claim your Huawei points if those are available. And that's how easy it is to buy anything with the Huawei App Gallery and how to get discounts on your packs. So once again, I want to thank Huawei App Gallery for sponsoring this video. And let's get back into the video. It's kind of annoying that my units are super spread out right now. Oh, goes for an early Sonia. Sony with that is definitely not bad. Let's go for these two. Juno, okay. Don't really think I care too much about Juno. Could be annoying though. Yeah, it could be actually annoying. We'll go Kraka good. They are okay. They're just okay. Okay, with that. Hmm. Question is, do I have to respect Juno that much or not? It's kind of the big question. I think I'll actually do this. And I think he will ban it. I'm gonna go for this. The predictability. If you had Vals, Bob, Vermeon, do you think any RTA teams for them? No, they're just last picks. Okay, I do outspeed, which does actually mean I have to go for this. Okay, but he moves on this afterwards. I am decently fast myself as well, but he could do decent damage to this still. Okay, he was decently fast. And hurting on that one. Okay, not too bad. But issue is this thing is uh, kind of in a bad spot for me right now. Oh, I did increase, that's not great. That glancing hit though, that a glancing hit. That might uh, be game for me. He actually did more damage on the Oliver than I expected him to do. Yeah, that's not bad, actually. Did increase over there. He does have his skill up again, but he has a tech break and shit. Uh, maybe I should have just sent it because I would have done a decent amount of damage actually on it. How does that... Oh, wait, it's Nam. That's why. Okay. Does have S2, S3 right now. Oh, doesn't. Uh, the attack break is in there, which is not that great. We freeze. Damn it. Really hoping for that freeze over there. Maybe a slight misplay. That's kind of a misplay too, I guess. Can't land my ships! Which isn't great. 
Okay, since you do not have any skills, I think I'd rather do on you. Okay, crit in mid, that's nice. Mm, should I just send it to kill? I could also just kill with you later on, so I don't think... And these two are probably not going to be via. This one will most definitely have skills. Man, this thing is never freezing. At least he can become big. Oh, he did actually resist that. I think against these guys, I should just straight up steal Hay Gang because otherwise they will probably Hay Gang with Leyland shit. Hmm, Zima style. Okay. So far, he only has one speed lead. Chandra. Okay, okay. So, probably his way of stripping is going to be, or his way of uh, pushing up is going to be this thing. I think it moves in front. Rather than after. Would I go for Barbara style on this? Not sure. Not sure. Could go Ethna as well. Ethna ban on this or something. Do I like that idea? I kind of do. Pants out the hay gang. Okay, okay, interesting. So then it's kind of a speed battle who's faster between the Charlotte and my units, but I should be faster, I guess. Higher lead. Didn't armor break the one I wanted to armor break, but it's actually not bad to just get rid of you more or less. damage though just a skill one kills yeet hey yeet eighth okay yeah you had to play top four or something to play in the summit right we got Akarius with a tier one or 30 months appreciate it okay so he does have a two fast units two speed leads hmm. it's too much fire units i could go for a barbara and just make him fear that it's fast well it's actually not that fast Okay, that part didn't work out. <laughs> they just don't like Jews. Or, or, or the, the, the Hay Gangs. Okay, okay. Then probably anything else but the Barbara would have been better. But let's just see how that rolls. Hmm. We can get a random stun. Okay, that didn't work out. We boost enough. We do boost enough. Ah, uh, we didn't push back. That pushback would have been so huge if I actually landed that. A full miss crit. That's an interesting one. Ah, uh, too bad. Didn't land shite. That's okay, bad, but not the worst. Can we proc back? Never lucky. No, proc back. Motherfucker. Motherfucker. 
Yeah, you can just go for clean kill right now. Yeah, that's a lot of debuffs. I don't like that part. Big guy, better get some stuns in. Mm, just one stun. And not enough damage on that one. Uh, also not enough damage. Shoot the horse. No, what? Uh, I'm lacking damage by the sliver of HP all the time. That's kind of annoying. Ah, uh, he does have S3, right? Yep, that sucks. Don't land. Does land. Don't crit. Okay. Big guy can solo this. I've seen big guy solo this. Okay, that's not too bad. Hopefully I still land. Nice. Yeah, then it's GG. There's no way this Masha wins big guy. Yep, absolutely not if I start blocking. Close match though. Pretty close match. I wish normal art yet. Pre-ban, I agree. They should make a pre-ban before you go into the match. So you just pre-ban, let's say you never want to play Leo. You just pre-ban Leo, done. Leave your Laura around? Nope. Okay, so who are you gonna hit? Uh, that's actually a lot more damage than I expected. Wow, holy shit. Okay, I have to do this. I didn't not expect this, so I need to do that much damage on the unit that was high HP as well. Or high speed. Okay, I guess. Yeah, it's just an issue I can't really land on Sonya's. That part is kind of an issue. Ah, uh, no armor break on the Sonya, that's bad. Okay, I need one more hit. He does have glancing though, that part is good. Yeah, that means 100% glancing on that. Let's give it a tech break as well. In it land. Okay. If I had the attack break on it, it would have been pretty nice. Because now he can go for the S2, he could crit. Oh, actually goes for slow. Interesting. Hmm, since I'm slow, I kind of don't want to go for the hit on that. That's not really great. I need a proc. Rips, never lucky. Yeah, that thing does do quite some damage. Uh, if I just had the attack break on you earlier, or one proc over there, I would have been fine. Oh, GG's. But yeah, that Sonya did do a lot more damage than I expected on like a similar speed unit. The runes accrued so much in a year. No, I kind of had these runes already before. Well, I would say my Despair runes, yes. My Despair runes definitely did improve. But my Vio runes uh, kind of been the same. They just have been more spread out. Like this set and uh, this set. Normally, they are more spread out. But I still have like a bunch of units that are like 188, 189 kind of stuff. But I would definitely say like I do farm a lot. And the recent buffs to farming have been giving me a lot of quads. Like the amount of times that you're attempting to roll a quad, it's pretty high right now. I hate this unit. Yeah, if there's no Varamos to keep this thing in check, then it's actually pretty strong. Going in with an Ethna. Okay. It's a thing like even a fire monkey is kind of counted by this thing. That's the bad part about it. When I go for Diana, I think Diana's also kind of countered by it, isn't it? I feel more in control with all these. Well, I do miss Smicer. Like I think everyone probably misses like one or two good units. For me, it's Smicer. 
Well, artifacts is always good to focus on a bit. Like, it's never really wrong to focus quite a bit on artifacts. Okay, my Chi was decently fast, but it's not fast enough to outspeed those, most likely. Would be nice if it is, because then I have, like, quite a head start on this match. Nope. Oh, it's too slow for both, even. It sucks. At least that didn't land, that's great. Okay, I love it if that unit dies on the first hit. I actually should I have went for an S3? I should have went for an S3. Oh, I got resisted anyways. Don't disperse them, thank you. I think I'll just straight up send it. Because then I have a chance to stun it as well. Nice. No glancing on this thing, great. You'll love to see it. Uh, Dio is playing that uh, shenanigans with the Sonya as well, from what I saw. Uh, not sure how much I'm gonna be liking that. I should actually go for steals on those then. Let's actually give Layla a try. Didn't use her yet. Oh, uh, also has the Siri, that's annoying. That is actually annoying. Thing is, these things just do a shit ton of damage no matter what. Well, let's see. I didn't make my Layla too tank for... Uh... Oh wait, I should have picked Layla defense lead. I'm an idiot. I could have actually... Well, I think that you would have still been able to get hit though. Yeah, these things just do an insane amount of damage. Okay, okay. Nice stuns though. Uh, I missed everything on you? Like not a little bit, no, 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 everything? <laughs> That's not great. Wow, another resistance. Wow, and he lands that. That's not great. I hate these things where you just land wrong element, man. Yeah, at least we managed to kill one. Thing is that the call time on that is just super short. You just came from a proc, bro. We can literally revive a already again. Can we get another disperse stun? Nope. Yeah, and he can boost up. Man, that's so unlucky though. Like, the amount of procs that this thing had is insane. Why that one though? Ah, uh, full freaking glanced as well. Come on, man. DU second pretty big. Encounters. Uh, I think that this is my only chance and hope that I counter on his hit. Counter on this. Okay, there's some chance. Some chance it is slim though. Good counter. Love you, Juno. Mm, decent stun. Lovely Juno, lovely. That's why I'm giving you those good runes. You can't crit on water. Oh, fully can't crit? That's annoying, actually. I'm not sure if Juno at some point gets faster because of the speed buff, though. That could be a thing. I don't have Smicer, though. That's one of the few normal units. I don't have Byuncho and I don't have Smicer. Those are the only normal elemental units that I don't have, which I would like to have. Fly right, to the man K. Wait, your damage... Did I put you... No, I should actually put your damage on fire. It does make sense. Someone else was mentioning that I should... Elio. Yeah, okay. Fair. Hmm. 
What do we like to bring into those? Fire Cassandra is not really too much of my liking at the moment. I could actually go for you plus you. Miles would have been an option. Miles would have not been that bad, no. My Miles is actually kind of tech where, well, no. This thing would still land on the Miles, but he's tech for near 100 rest. But I, I ruined some runes on him, apparently. Would I remove this? I do think I... Yeah, there's either, like, I snipe something or I reset something. That's... Either I reset this thing or I have the buff and I uh, snipe that thing. And I do think that I can actually snipe you even if I don't have attack buff. Pretty confident in that one. Okay, we're gonna see how that works out. If I want to do the real risk play, I should actually snipe the monkey, but I don't think I will. That is very nice. You from Netherlands? Yes, I are. I am. Nice resistance over there, I guess. Uh, I think I'd rather land on you than on you, do I? No, I'd rather land on you. Okay, okay. Uh, in this case, I think I would trigger you too much if I were to go for that, so I don't want to. Do you speak German? Uh, not really, no. Okay, that triggered. It's fine. Nice slow. Don't proc into a steel. He did just proc into a steel. Is that enough? Ah, uh, fuck. That's going to be enough, right? Yep. Ah, uh, that sucks so much. That proc just won him the game. What? Bro. He needs, like, the two luckiest moments for proccing to actually make any slide of chance, and he gets both. Hi. Hate those moments. But we still have a chance. Oliver likes to ruin his chance though. Okay, nice slow. Would I lap with that slow though? That's the part I'm not too sure about. Yeah, Oliver, if you actually landed your skills, you would have had skills up. Life would have been nice and shit. Don't stun this, please. Can we maybe kill? Man, why can't I not proc back for a perfect moment? Bro, you came from three back-to-back -back procs. Say what? Okay, you will move next, but I have to make sure that it is enough damage. Okay, that way it is enough damage. Still no procs my side, though. That part is kind of odd. yee -hoo. Yee-hoo, little proppies. Fuck on this one? No, I get resisted on that one instead. That helps, I guess. Don't tell me you have skills, right? Wait, I got resisted again, so I don't have skills. Okay, that's firmly where my proc went. <laughs> Jesus! This match would have been like a hundred thousand times easier if it wasn't for RNG Brockery. But it's the same thing from Dutch to English. They're all Germanic languages. Germanic languages. It's the same as like Latin languages. They share a lot of uh, stuff. Uh, the defense on you is not that crazy. Let's actually go for double snipe. Just because I want. He probably goes for Nessa Nan afterwards, but we shall see. Ew. Oh, this guy's the anti fun himself. Fire Monk. Huh? Slightly different than I thought. Will we go for Coco? We're gonna have fun with Coco. We're gonna have fun with Coco. Coco Smicer out. Uh, this thing does have high defense. It has more chance of being anti-defense than that other thing, though. But you dropping the bomb on this thing means death. I think we have to go this route. Ooh, that was the perfect one to ban out in this case. Bonjour, mademoiselle. No, my French is really bad. Any nice ladies in the, the Netherlands disco, is it? I literally 
I haven't been going out like a long ass time over here. Uh, I could wait with doing skills and then do that on you later, or I could try to reset you. Let's actually go for reset. Okay, let's go for a reset and a stun on everyone. Oh, uh, you missed it. No, I didn't. Coco Prox. You could potentially stun the Coco. Just definitely think. Can we stun this? No stun. Mm -mm -mm -mm. I think I'm gonna go for this one. And that didn't work out. Let's snipe you out because we... Oh, 32k. That was... Wow, that's a super tanky monkey. Holy shit. That is actually a very tanky monkey. Hmm. hmm. Yikes. And everyone and their moms, tanky is so freaking, or monkey is so freaking tanky. By branding with branding, extra damage. Yes, sir. Uh, that is stunner. Uh, I hate when this thing lands armor breaks, bro. Uh, Procket, not that crazy of a moment. Oh, this was not really helpful. I'm not sure if I'm winning this random stun. Not so random stun. That one is dead. Should I sacrifice my Oliver? Nah, my Oliver is just casually gonna proc. Ooh, he just did that. Still have the issue with... Uh... Oh, well, he also just did that, I guess. Hmm. Hmm. It's that you didn't kill, otherwise you would have had your skills back already. But you don't in this position. Oh, that is going to be rip the cycling. No random feeds. Did you send it on this one? Okay. Thing is, I am going to take a turn. With that turn, I'm going to one-shot you. 55k! Holy shit! Oh no, he did not just survive that as well. Our people building the fire monkeys that might thank Bruiser 100 crit rate. I was surprised that this thing actually did survive. This thing has like no defensive stats. Well, a little bit, but not much. By Cassandra Artis, uh, pure on crit damages up. It doesn't look like much, but it's like all over the place kind of style. And it does actually, this thing also does help the attack low. Because it is somewhat common for her to be low attack when she does hit, right? And then this thing is just a uh, spread out everything crit damage up. In the end, this is 37 crit damage. So that does add up on a unit like this. Thanks for watching. If you would like to see more guides, join the Discord and check out the content tab, which has the dungeon guide archive and the video guide archive, which contains all of the guides that you need. Hope to see you there.